can't stop okay, okay, hustling okay, okay. every minute, every second. Y'all probably wondering, what's this dude guy got on kinds of face masks and hoods and this and that? Don't worry about it. Mind your own business. I may or may not have been trying to find pizza rolls upstairs when everybody's asleep. Yo, over here, boy. Well, bros, brews, and botches, bringing to you an episode of Sips, ain't it? Yo, today we're going to be talking about Wishing Star from Highland Brewing Company out of Asheville, North Carolina. This 6.8% cold IPA features the Strata Hops, in which they say they shine with tropical citrus character in a dank cold IPA. So what's a cold IPA? A cold IPA is an IPA that is fermented at lower temperatures than a traditional IPA, and it was kind of started by Wayfinder Brewing Company in Portland, Oregon. They decided like, hey man, what can we do with an IPA that hadn't already been done? Let's throw some lager yeast in it and ferment it at colder temperatures. So you get more lighter body feel and something closer to that of a lager. Yeah, but still hoppy though. Strata hops come in with a little bit of a tropical thing going on throughout the beer, but if they dry hop the beer with it, that's when you get the more grapefruity tones and the cannabis notes out of it. So if I had to guess, they probably use the hops throughout the entire process during both the boil and in the dry hop phase. And if you wanna know what that is, maybe I might tell you or maybe not, don't matter. Anyway, let's give it the scent test, ain't it? All right, so this definitely has like some tropical fruit. It's like you mashed up mangoes and this and that, but also if you took a big old nug and threw it in there and crushed it up too, because it does have that dank dank towards the end of it. And I feel, I feel it might taste like that too, ain't it? You'll Let's give it a taste test. Oh yeah. So this coming off the rip, you get all kinds of cool little citrusy, tropical notes into it. And then right at the end, you get that dank that you may or may not be accustomed to. And if you ain't, sorry, but you're missing out in life. And if you are, good onions. If you think that might be something that hits you, I would definitely give it a shot. For over here, boy, this is gonna be a three and three quarters caps out of five. And the only reason why is because I don't really like that aftertaste as much, especially if I have a whole bunch of them and I start burping them up, don't like it. I call them the weed burps. Yeah, you know, you know. Anyway, you already know what it is. Check this can out. Yep. Check it out on the link tree in the bios in the description. Check out what Yellow Boy and Hogs Wars is doing, especially Yellow Boy at this point in time on the Twitch streams. He's playing games all the time. It's so good. And then check out Shot of Brew. And then check out Hogs Wars on his Instagram. That guy's doing all kinds of big work. Big girt. Old dirt McGirt. Anyway, I'm done talking about it. You already know what it is. Cheers to y'all. And now I got to get back in together so I can go get them pizza rolls, ain't it? 